<laughs> where, uh, where do you stand with Bregman and the Astros? Has there been any? Um... Yeah, Dana and I talked about that today, and, and obviously, you know, Alex has made it clear that he's open and listening to whatever the Astros have to say. How you kind of alluded to it up there, but how different is his situation maybe as, as compared to Jose's? Well, you know, uh, Jose did somewhat of a bridge contract because of the first contract he signed. And uh, in uh, his, uh, in Alex's case, obviously, he's more in a normal free agency dynamic that you would see both age-wise. So uh, obviously that has um, more uh, uh, impact in the uh, free agent market for valuation and length of contract and all those things. So um, that's that's something that, you know, he's a rather prestigious player because these guys that play here to, you know, when we look around at teams and the core of those teams, and, you know, and being in the, I mean, it's one thing, to win a world championship is rare to win two, but to be in the championship series seven years in a row, it's just, it's just not being done. It's just really not. And you have to look to the players who are, are integral in that from start to finish have been part of it. And Jose and Alex were, are really have been the, the core of that. Uh, and then, of course, the additions of Alvarez and Tucker and, and such have certainly added, added to that and, and Pena, too. But... Uh, but th those two guys have been the cornerstone of, of the franchise, sure.